What's new crew and welcome back to another grocery haul. This is the first one of 2020. I almost said 2019, but first one of 2020. And I'm actually gonna be showing you guys a fill-in haul um for January. I've never shown you guys what a fill-in haul looks like for us. So about halfway through the month, we end up going back. I usually just end up placing a really small Walmart pickup order and Joe picks it up on his way home. Usually I spend between like 25 and $60 on that grocery haul depending on how good I did my first like once a month grocery shopping at the beginning of the month if I forgot things um, if we need pull-ups or wipes or diapers or something like that then usually my budget goes up a little bit or like a bag of cat food or dog food or something like that then I'll end up spending a little bit more. It also depends on the time of year because come summertime, we put the garden in and that gives us a lot of our fresh vegetables and fruits and stuff. But it being winter, I'm not relying on the garden or anything like that for fresh fruits and vegetables. So it ended up costing a little bit more than it usually does. And usually at the beginning of the month, I shop at Walmart and Aldi, but if you're new, we had a baby boy join us on the first of this year. Um, Colt made a very surprise arrival at 38 weeks. So I did not be, I wasn't able to do like my huge grocery shopping. I only put in a Walmart pickup order for about half of what I normally do. So this time my grocery haul was a little bit bigger than what it normally is. So because Colt joined us rather unexpectedly, this one's grocery haul is a little bit bigger. I spent a hundred and some dollars. I'll have to look at my receipt, but I'll put it on the screen. I think it was like right around a hundred bucks I ended up spending. Ooh. So I spent right around a hundred dollars and um, I know already that I'm going to have to go and pick up some more stuff. Forgot cat food, so we needed a bag of cat food. We already went through one loaf of bread. Um, and I only got this Walmart order two days ago, so I'm gonna need another loaf of bread for sure um, Probably another gallon of milk because the gallon of milk they gave me for the pickup order expires in like Less than a week, so we're probably gonna need another gallon of milk It happens. It is what it is, but I'm gonna hop in and show you guys my mid-month grocery haul for our family of five we got a thing of Coffee filters. I needed more of these Cookie dough ice cream, always. I got the these little birthday ice cream cups for the girls for a little treat. I got three of these body armors. They're supposed to be really good to help boost milk supply, and I'm trying to be able to pump and freeze, so I got some of these to try. Got a thing of fruit snacks for the girls. A thing of kettle chips, two things of this butter popcorn for the weekend. It won't last past the weekend anyways. I got a pizza for lunch today, a thing of diced ham, we're doing a fish fry tomorrow at Joe's parents and his parents want me to bring a salad so I got that for salad, two things of honey wheat bread, I got some brownies to make with the girls some point this week, a uh, pancake mix, a thing of goldfish, we were out of that, I got a one five pound bag of apples, oh three pound bag of apples, uh, I got six bananas, I think, a thing of chicken patties, I just wanted something like quick and easy for um, some lunches for the next two weeks, so hopefully that'll be good. I got a thing of these um, M&Ms for a little treat for the girls. I needed uh, to have a quick breakfast um, on hand just in case I needed it with how mornings are running lately, so I got a thing of these. A jug of Sunny D. We needed another jug of milk. The girls are currently working on these little cookies. I got a big family size pack. No, mine. We got another box of mac and cheese for no, another quick mine. lunch. I got two bags of tomatoes for sandwiches, the salad we're doing, and um, the girls like to eat these like sliced with lunches all the time too, so 24 count. Hot dogs, these are for the mac and cheese or just for lunches for the girls. They'll fly through these, they snack on these all the time during the day too. A big bag of cherry berry blend. They substituted this for me, but this is a three pound bag. The girls will use these for snacks and um, on the side for lunches and 
And then I got two things of the like Greek vanilla yogurt. We've been flying through this this month. We already went through two. So I got two more for the next two weeks and hopefully that'll last us until next month. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram. It's at Cassie and Crew. I have some really fun things in the works that are going to be happening over on my Instagram. Oh, kid life, mom life. Kids are fighting over stickers. It is what it is. <laughs> um, but go ahead and follow me over on my Instagram. It's at Cassie and Crew. And I guess I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.